I don't have anything. I, I, we said just to go with it. <laughs> I have nothing. Well, life's too short, so love the one you got. Uh -huh. You might get run over, or you might get drowned in a lake, and your name might be Kate Vine. <laughs> let's see what's going on today. <laughs> All right, let's just, let's let's walk along, because now it's 9 p.m., and my name is Kieran. I am Detective William G. Smith Esquire. Oh, fuck, I just sound like a loser now. <laughs> I don't even. I don't have an Esquire. I don't have a. I don't have a. Detective. Esquire apparently means you're a lawyer. I think so. Yes, really, yeah. that doesn't make any sense for me to say that. No, you could be. Phoenix Wright is totally a. I guess he inspects. Yeah, and, he's absolutely an inspector and a lawyer at the same time. That's he's true. always stupid on the crime scene. And never gets arrested. Objection, bub. Snicked. I'm waiting for it to be locked. Yeah, just. And we're gonna need that gonna screwdriver go again. Uh, <gasps> oh, what's this? There's a screwdriver. A gun! Oh. A light! A flashlight! Oh, All at that place! I never remember to buy one. <laughs> Just I've... take it. Take it and run. <laughs> I've never bought one. And I, I never remember. will. <laughs> now I never have to. Can you do that as an inspector? Just take a bunch of shit? I'm fairly sure no. I don't. Right? Like, are you supposed to not I don't think you fuck can. around with shit? Well, no, I suppose forensics has already been there. You're there yeah. to fuck shit up. Okay, nothing happened here. Now we know. Oh, no so, burn um, marks on the ground. Figured we'd see... Well, that fire was very real. <laughs> <laughs> figured we'd see, like, a stack of corpses of students. Questions, if you don't mind. So what's with the... What the hell were you doing in there? <laughs> so what do you think about this red torch? <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so let's work our way down, because we... Had we a whole got, bunch of shit. We haven't got to talk to him for for a minute. He was busy. Uh, he was busy we burning a whole, dolls. A whole hour. Tell me more about this doll burning. It's a symbolic ceremony we perform <laughs> every few weeks on the court. What's it about? It's about burning your old personality and finding a new one, a better one. So the dolls are you. They represent you from the past. Each doll has a picture of the student as a child or a teenager. Uh, and they burn the doll and symbolically destroy their old personality. It's quite simple. Did the doll that we saw uh, yeah. Why did have that a picture on it? Shout? No, no, it didn't. Because it's an emotional thing. She, she quite clearly becomes very attached to her doll. They do <laughs> see the first. Apparently, the guy who plays Ryan was in charge of the casting for this. Oh, uh, really? Burnings. Oh, so that is that why he's on I, level? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I need someone I think, to go toe-to-toe -to -toe -to -toe with me. I think that's why, like, I mean, I know he we're really is, but, like, I feel like that's why everyone's a little campy, because, like, he's like, no, this is how we're doing this. We should make a doll of you, Inspector, and burn that. What do you think? No, uh, is that a threat? Right. Yeah. Uh, do you know what effigies are? Anyway. <laughs> Excuse oh, uh, me? Uh, what? Can you tell me about all the this? <laughs> No. It's all in the hands, hands and the <laughs> eyes, Rupert. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> dip into it occasionally, but uh, it's not a major feature of the course. I would say that, well, a minority of the students know how to use it, but the majority wouldn't know and have a clue. It's not a requirement of the course. No, not at all. We don't, we don't ask people to do things that they're not comfortable with. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I had a little seizure there. But they're not... <laughs> What's the reason for that? Uh, well, to be perfectly honest with you, Inspector, it doesn't actually work very well. Believe me, I've tried. Huh. Doesn't... In, that's interesting. That's an interesting thing to end his statement with. Doesn't believe it actually works? Well, that I doesn't work well. You as in, he has another method oh, to do. Well, mm. I'm not really a musician. I mean, I, I, I dabble a little bit. To be quite honest with you, I'm far more interested in collecting guitars. You're not in a band. Uh, well, I, I did audition. I, I, did I do audition often find that weirdly ago, more interesting when there are people like, no, I don't play guitar, but I collect <laughs> them. Like, I've met a couple people who... <laughs> yeah, I like know people like that. Oh, I can't remember. Something Stone. <gasps> all called Something Stone. Hammerstone. That's it. No. And you still collect? Um, I haven't bought a guitar for over a year. I feel I've moved on. Over a year, as in he had killed the ex-guitar player. Now go. he's like, now I'm the best now guitarist in town. Guitar. <laughs> yeah, so what about this Do shit? You know what this is. You've seen this bag before? Well, I think it's a bag. <laughs> 
Is it a bag, Inspector? Oh, uh, <laughs> fuck you! Uh, yeah, yes, put it over his head. Get job. out! Yes, we used to hire from them. For the course? Well, yes. For the course, at the end of each stage, we have a, a, a little party and we ask students to dress up or try acting out uh, being somebody new. Their new selves. Are... You know, a murderer, a crazy yeah. serial killer. New selves. Hmm. One of the main elements of the course is learning how to act, how to be whoever you need to be in any given situation. I think right. you agree. I can you know, helps in, helps in business. Being the right person in the right see? situation. See, like that. No, yeah, like I, I, I can <laughs> see does, the logic <laughs> there. To detach themselves, become somebody new, pretend. You know, you know that kind of thing. It's surprising what a little bit of cross dressing. <laughs> just going back and forth. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty great line. With cro <laughs> it's amazing what cross dressing can do for a man. You should try it, Inspector. Yeah. And, not at this stage. <laughs> what do you know about your father's money? Get a couple of drinks and old yeah. Jinxy and we'll see, what he, <laughs> we'll see who no, comes out. It's only when the chief's around and calls him Jinxy. <laughs> yeah. The shock aspect of the course. But he went too far, you believe. <laughs> he usually does. Is that obvious? And do you think it did have anything to do with Liam's death? No, 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 no. <laughs> Liam wasn't like that at all. I mean, that was just... Say no five no, times to convince yourself. Yeah. <laughs> he had problems, but he didn't have any problems with the money shock stunt. No. Money shock stunt. I'm sorry, the show. Okay. What about this? What do you know about... M oh, we got a front Roman shot, I criticizing think. Criticizing Liam a before different angle? suicide. Yeah. <sighs> I was there, I witnessed it. Uh, well, I, I know Emma what? blamed herself for his death. She witnessed. Oh, oh no, yeah, that's right. He, when, when she said it. Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> I wouldn't blame it. <laughs> she had anything to do with it at all. You don't think? Liam was a very confident person, very outgoing, very strong individual, or so it seemed. I mean, people are free to do what they like. Even something as irreversible as bumping themselves off. Sad though that is, of course. Yeah, that means something else to me. Yeah. <laughs> Over here in Amer America, that's uh, something different. America. <laughs> okay, so right. we definitely got some There's shit gotta here. There's got to be something here. All right, so this occurs every few weeks. weeks. Students carry the doll with them for a month. I don't think we have a contradiction with that. However, that's an interesting thing. Did he ever uh, mention... Uh, maybe something with the scrying mirror? I was just thinking, yeah, thinking about that. Oh, no, that's no, right. Yeah, he doesn't, doesn't believe anything supernatural shit. now. Um, that's right. On the edition of our band called Hammerstone, do we have anything that would be like, fuck you, no, that's not it? I don't know if we have anything that would... Nothing's... Nothing that jumps out at me? Yeah, I don't think we have a piece of evidence to link him to it right now. Yeah, it would have been up there. Um, what are we here? Had met Liam in the pub. That's where they would be playing. Yeah. Uh, Liam seemed happy. Hmm. Um. Man, not playing this for like a week. I'm oh, I know, I back. know. There's so much to be like. <laughs> What did they say? Yeah, yeah, I'm trying to trying to remember everything he said. Uh no it's not related to Liam's suicide. Uh used to hire from the shop. And the mask, uh Paul said comes from the cart uh, the the the, uh, the monarch. Yeah, the costume place. It said made by a friend. Who died last year? Yeah. <laughs> That's huh? Cryptic. Yeah. Um, and let's have an end of stage party. Course involves teaching students how to act. Party includes wearing costumes. Um, do you want to go talk to uh, Paul? Then yeah, come we can back talk here because I think yeah. I think um, that'll be a good refresher, and we'll probably I, I think he'll probably have something else. Okay. Yeah, because yeah, nothing's jumping out of here. Because right now we also yet. have this that we can go uh, yeah. oh, see, see what that Actually, yeah, to. I, I want to investigate behind the pub or wherever. We might have what we need right here, but I don't know what to do. Are you kidding uh, me? Is this game doing that glitch thing where it's not letting us exit? Oh, my God. Yeah, it's doing that thing. Weird. All right, we'll be right back just a second. And we're back. Woo! 
Huh, okay, so we had to replay everything. Yeah, this whole game. <laughs> whole game. No, no. <laughs> this is what we had started today, but yeah, sometimes, uh, for those of you trying this at home, uh, let us know if you ever encounter this and yeah. find a way to fix it. Yeah, because I'm, I'm so gonna lie. Every so often during interviews, it'll just like the exit button won't light up when you mouse over it and you can't access it. So you yeah. can't leave. You're trapped in the interview. <laughs> At first, I thought this was like a feature and it was like, there's a, con there's there's a contradiction. Oh, you gotta here, do it, yeah. And you can't do it and you can't leave until you get it. But no. <laughs> no, it's just. Not saying there wasn't a contradiction there that we missed, just saying that yeah. uh, that is not a feature. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we, so we had to see it all a second time and. <laughs> I still didn't glean anything new, so nothing either we're at me. dumb as bricks or Did there's we just ask nothing right now. Simon about Emma's guilt. No, we didn't, but we have a torch and we need to use yeah, it. Yeah, okay. We have, to, we have the to red light, torch. Yeah, we have to light a pub on fire. All right, let's do this. Oh, we need to go behind the pub. Oh shit! And I just kind of wanted to shine it in her face and make sure she's, you know, <laughs> make sure she's still lucid. <laughs> you, you, you put it on, she's like, <laughs> <laughs> and she just, you know, bursts into flame. If a flashlight worked on vampires, then that would be the best. That would be crazy. Did you ever uh, take flashlights out on like a dark night and have like fake lightsaber fights with them? Like, yeah, like, I would absolutely okay. do right, that. Cool. Wanted to make sure that and oh. flashlight tags are like my favorite things. Yeah. And we have a oh, it's just trash. A flyer, Hammerstone playing tonight. Oh, what do you got? Car. My, my suicide note. <laughs> Signed, Paul. What? <gasps> oh, okay. shit. Well, and there's the mask symbol again. Looks like someone's been trying to make a point. Huh. Interesting. So that's Ryan's car, right? That vandalized photos of a car. No, uh, is that Ryan's car? So I feel like Ryan is the only one with a car we've No, we saw um, with. Paul's. No, Paul was using Ryan's car. No, it said Rand Man, random, whatever <laughs> was on the back. Yeah, and of it. remember when he called? Because when we first met Paul, right before we went to his interview, like Paul called Ryan, I got his cell phone. He's like, I haven't been able to go anywhere. You've had my car. Oh yeah, that's right. And real quick though, because if his car is here, we can see. No, okay, that's no, that's a, that is a different, different one. Well, it's, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I was gonna say, did they just paint it? Get the so is that Paul's car then? Maybe. Is he driving a fucking whatever that is? Dude, he's in charge of two business schools. <laughs> yeah, two business, business courses. <laughs> hey, whose car is, is this? Yeah, so whose car is this? <laughs> Do you know what these are? Yes, that's Ryan's car. All right, the answer is that. Well, oh, there we go. Boy, he managed to ruin. It was <laughs> vandalized sometime last year. It's been a while. Yeah, I know. I missed you. I don't believe anybody was ever prosecuted for it. But someone might have died. <laughs> <laughs> but someone certainly died for it. <laughs> Emma's criticism of Liam on that last night led to his suicide. I doubt it helped. Did you encourage Emma to criticize him? I didn't encourage Emma to do anything. I merely told her what we tell every student to do, to express themselves as they want to. It would be out of order to criticize them after that, wouldn't it? However, I didn't expect her. Jinx's face right there is the face I'm making. <laughs> I'm just I'm just so happy to hear him. <laughs> if that's what it was. That's a decision she took herself. So you didn't know her well? No. Not at all. Hmm. Hardly knew Emma. Yeah, we got most of this stuff with him. Okay. Didn't encourage Emma to criticize Liam's worth, Mark. Didn't expect Emma to discuss it. Hardly knew Emma. Really? Do we have anything that would say uh, otherwise? I think you said he gave a gift to a student that was the <gasps> necklace, and we're Oh, yeah, positive. that's right. He absolutely gave it to her. We're fairly positive that's who, he, she's talk, who he's talking about. Uh, insist he didn't buy it for Kate. Bought it for, for the necklace for a student. Let's see if that works, because we're pretty- Yeah! You say you didn't know Emma, uh, yet you bought her. Got really excited. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't done this in a while. Yeah, it's been a minute. We've uh, had, a, had a contradiction. Emma, a so you didn't buy her one? <laughs> so you did buy her one? 
<laughs> Eat a dick, old man. We got you. <laughs> Look, I've been around a few years. The clock is ticking. And I What? I Hold on. Did she have an affair, affair with, with him? him also? Yeah. Women. <gasps> oh, come on. Uh, but that's <laughs> James is like, go you on. You slept with the cub, so now sleep you. with Papa Bear. <laughs> I bought her a necklace. I'm not aware that there's a law <laughs> against buying presents, unless, of course, the Third Reich has been <laughs> a bridge party. Emma God, I would not go to a bridge party with this man. <laughs> right. And as a matter of fact, she decided that she didn't want to be bothered with an old fool like Okay, me. okay, all right. Nothing Whew. happened, no mistakes, nobody got hurt. All right. Father, like Sounds like you're a little yeah, upset. Yeah. Surprises there. I wonder how many students Paul has tried it on with. <laughs> that's a that's a broad broad question. Say, once tried to date Emma. Um, that opens up a can of worms here. Tried to. Let's see. It wasn't at the pub. Um. Wouldn't say anything about her. I don't know if that unlocks anything. Yeah, I don't. I don't think that's right gonna. Here. Yeah, like nothing's jumping out of me yet. But maybe later he'll be like, "No, it's incredibly wrong to date a student." And we'll be like, "Excuse me." Also, he's totally fucking lying. Ryan says it's still working. They're trying to phase it out. Auto hypnosis is not used on the course anymore. Ryan said that they yeah. use it, but some people just don't get it. Yeah, and unfortunately, we. Unfortunately, that's just a contradiction between two people. Yeah, which, I know. Which, in a way, makes sense because, like, if someone else is wrong, like, that is not their fault. Yeah. <laughs> like, Ryan might be like, no, we still use it, but they don't, and he just doesn't realize it because he's an idiot. Like, mm -hmm. he seems pretty inept in a lot of things. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like his daddy says. <laughs> Another toy <laughs> managed to ruin. I can't remember the line he said when he was like, when he first was introduced and Ryan, like, walked away all sad. <laughs> I can't remember what he said. He said something great. I know there's the one where we talked, we brought up Rebecca for something. And he goes, she likes to be in control. <laughs> like Ryan. How unfortunate. Because I control them both. Oh, like, yeah. It's just like this, <laughs> yeah. Oh, you are the evil emperor. <laughs> okay. I don't think we have anything right now. Um, he tried to date her, but I don't think that... Yeah, that's right. I can't, I can't remember what he said about the guitar. Um, let's see. He didn't didn't steal from Liam that night. Why wouldn't... Hmm. No, I guess we don't have anything. Yeah, nothing's... Nothing's jumping out of me yet. Uh, I, I want to show these to Ryan real quick. Yeah. Hey, what happened to your car, man? Because I think that'll open up. Who for thinks us to get you're him. a devil worshiper? <laughs> also, that girl you slept with, your dad tried to bang her. <laughs> you're getting sloppy seconds, Ryan. How do you feel? From your I old man! <laughs> a couple more questions, if that's okay. Do hey, what's you this? Know what, uh, these... Speaking of a red uh, torch. <laughs> oh, yes, that's my old car. Uh, it was vandalized. Um, I took those for the insurance company. Where did you find those? At the pub. Uh, you know who did this? <laughs> I stole them! <laughs> yeah. A girl called Lisa Blint. She was on the course. Very strange girl. Ooh. And why did you ah. suspect the words devil worshippers all over your car? Well, she was a very strange girl. She had a lot of psychological problems. Uh, I saw her in class. She's the one who threw the doll. <laughs> she, she took a dislike to the course for some particular reason. I couldn't quite put my finger on it. <laughs> Maybe because she thought you worshipped the devil. And she decided to spray her disapproval all over my car. Odd thing to spray, isn't it, though? Devil worshippers? <laughs> Well, she was a very odd girl, Inspector. Uh, maybe she thought it was a way of getting back at us. I have no idea. Did Rebecca know about it? Well, yes, she did, but I, was, I wasn't about to unleash Rebecca on her. She can be quite... Oh. Old, you know? and, I mean, the girl wasn't vindictive. Mm. She had psychological problems. She lives in the village, actually. 
Uh, a <gasps> run-down house at the end of the lane. Can't miss it. That opened really? up. Boom. Right. New location. You. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just going to uh, chug yeah. this. got to take a big old drink when I think about um, Lisa. Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. No, he, oh yeah, he says he doesn't know how these could be used, but we know they're used on the course. Yeah, but they're not taught by the course. It's something no, the students started it's doing. It's the Three Freedoms thing, isn't it? Yeah, it's something the students started doing it to, to show like their devotion to the course. It, it wasn't taught. <laughs> the devotion to business. Yeah. <laughs> I love business so much. <laughs> um, You're this, so full of shit, dude. This This whole thing reminds me of like a... Uh, like a sorority or something that's just gone insane. Like, <laughs> yeah, I, it started yeah. off as like, we'll we'll get together and we'll learn business <laughs> tactics. We'll learn like all this. Because we're all business then, majors. But, yeah, but then someone like in the course is like, guys, you know what? I feel like it's kind of like you metaphorically put on a mask at a business meeting. What if we bought masks? <laughs> all right, no, that sounds yeah, cool, yeah, Ryan. Good. good, good ideas. <laughs> just like, uh, yeah. and then it's just spun out into this. <laughs> no, we have to burn these the dolls, dolls and steal from each other and make each other feel yeah. bad because that's what business <laughs> is about. It's all about guys. business. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just like I don't want to play anymore. This isn't fun anymore, guys. No, no. <laughs> I came here. To, I came here to help people. <laughs> oh wait, no. This. There we go. Okay, so house at the end of the lane, right? All the way down here. Yeah, that's what you said. All right, well, let's go. Let's go okay. here and then walk down. End of the lane. <clears throat> See if anything pops out at us. We haven't talked to James for a like bit. a murderer. Could that be where Lisa lives? Run down house at the end of the lane. That's what. Try the old <laughs> house. You try it. I kind of want it to be wrong. We, are you Lisa? No. No. She lives down that way. Why'd you breathe, Jenks? No hesitation. Come on. You're a champ. Is it Lisa? Yes. Uh, Inspector Jenks, I'm investigating an incident in the village. I wonder if I could ask you a few questions. What sort of no. incident? No. Fuck you, pig. I'd rather come in and discuss it if that's all right with you. I promise I won't take long. You can't trick me, vampire. I have to invite you into my home. <laughs> yeah. Go in here. Yes. I have to go out in a minute. Oh, oh, look, I, I can come back. Oh, who is that? What did you want to ask? That actress looks so familiar. I just wanted to ask you. Did you know Kate Vine? No. Of course what? I know Kate Vine. That's me. Well, I heard that you're familiar with Atlas. The, uh, I drowned my <laughs> former self in a lake. Yeah. What do you want to know about Atlas? Well. I oh, the music. reacted badly to it. Of course, I reacted badly. So would anyone. Now, why do you say that? Uh, Simon seems pretty cool with it. Because they're devil worshippers. <gasps> devil worshippers. They're making demons appear. Oh my god, Yo. please. Everybody I want this to become Silent Hill. <laughs> you join up, then they're putting demons inside them. You can see them. See who? Demons. Oh, uh, okay. Like that yeah. Ryan fella. Did you see them? In the mirror. Right. Right. Any what? what? Mirror. You can't get rid of them. Do oh. I have demons? <laughs> yeah, you pull out the mirror shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, once you look at a black mirror, you're possessed. You get rid of them. I didn't. I didn't. You said Oh, that. yeah. Don't you? <laughs> Camera just cuts <gasps> back I to Jinx. Oh my god. I put all the lights on. Make sure it's all bright. I put them on when I need to look in the mirror. If I make sure everything is bright, I just see myself without. Maybe this is a doom seeing prequel. The other person. <laughs> Like me, but has older. horns and sixes. It's like her eyes sink in. She's all wrinkled with a wrinkled mouth. Like she's dying. I see my future. And then I realize 
I'm her. Oh, don't say that about yourself. You're beautiful. Not me yeah. anymore. I'm her. I'm sorry, my house is haunted. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, I, I have to go now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But, but. So I can look around your house? Yeah, so, yeah. I know I'm a cop, but I have to ask you. Yeah. I don't have a warrant. <laughs> Them's the rules. <laughs> well. Yeah, he has nothing to say. What the shit? All right. Okay, um, so, so hang on, real quick. <laughs> Damn it, look at it! You fucking look at it, Jinx! I want to see you as a strolled up old man. <laughs> old man Jinx! Let's, uh, let's talk to, let's talk to James. Let's, let's see yeah. what he has to say about yeah. that. I feel like her, corroborate him, anything. I feel like him and this girl should hook up. They'd probably have some killer kids who would know mm. everything. A few more questions, please. Thank you. Uh, okay, so let's see. Didn't know anything about that. Wasn't anything about that. Doesn't care. Doesn't care. Yeah, but this. Know anything about these? Nope. Oh yeah, I did that. <laughs> Damn it, James! You get me every time. James, you, we've got to tone <laughs> down the energy <laughs> level. In or involved with devil worship? You met Lisa. Which Lisa are you talking about? Mad Lisa lives on her own. Doesn't like mirrors. Yeah, yeah, I've met her. <laughs> You think she's oh wait, he tries to sell a mirror. She's yeah, probably right. bad for business. She's got, she's got problems, don't you think? How do you know her? She came to the farm. Yeah, and if you can't look in a mirror and see the government sneaking up on you. <laughs> and what did she tell you? Nothing much. Except she thought the devil was after her. What did you tell her? Told her the devil needs a good reason to be after you. She was just like most That's people, really point. blind to herself. Too she's more extreme. It's all madnesses. Being blind to yourself. Now, can I interest you in a mirror I've painted black <laughs> and talk about the government some more? <laughs> uh, Lisa, I visited the farm a few times. I don't think we have anything. Yeah, this... Be back later on, if that's okay. I was waiting for her to be like, of course, <gasps> the demons. <laughs> <laughs> like, this yeah. to be like the, the last red string he needed to piece everything yeah. on his map and his... Killing floor together. <laughs> Let's ask him what he thinks about this. Yeah. Ask you a couple more things, please. Lisa, I bought her a necklace. Devil worship, Paul. I beg your pardon. Devil worship. <laughs> yeah, like what? <laughs> Am I missing something here? <laughs> we just showed you a picture of cars with devil worshipper on it. This seems like a fair question. We're a training company, we're not devil worshippers. What kind of a question is that? So you've no interest in the occult? No, Inspector, I have no occult. interest in the occult any more than I have interest in pool vaulting, cheese making, or snake charming. Anything oh, I my God. that I'm not interested in? That's fine, thanks. All right. Hang on. No interest in the occult, I think eh? that's a bunch of shit. How'd you know that shit then, huh, yeah. Mr. Dum Dum? Oh fuck. Wow. Okay, well, uh, hang on. The mask. No. If there's any way we can prove he has an interest in the occult, I think that's where it is. Uh. Did he ever mention anything about it? Not really. James made these, though. <laughs> yeah. That's where I thought the connection would be. <laughs> Between James and Lisa. Yeah. Yeah, me too. The fact that he was like, no, she's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> she's crazy. She thinks that Atlas group <laughs> worships the devil. Um. Nothing <laughs> paranormal here. No interest in the occult. What about these bottles? Uh, once or Simon's <laughs> homebrew? <laughs> No interest in the, in the occult, but once tried to date Emma. <laughs> Maybe we yeah, don't have anything. Yeah, I don't, I don't think we have anything yet. There might be something later, like, where we'll be like, hey, hold on a second. I'll we just found this pentagram in the <laughs> Atlas chamber here. Yeah. Uh, what's that about? I can hear the... Be like, I love the occult. 
Oh, just kidding. I love the occult. I can hear the screams of the damned coming the, from your basement. <laughs> that occult is... <laughs> oh, you oh, meant occult. <laughs> like, oh, we're actually a cult. Oh, I get it now. <laughs> just a few more questions, if you don't mind. Just a few more just questions. Has <laughs> devil worship <laughs> ever been part of the course, Ryan? Am I correct? Yeah, didn't even let him finish. I with you. I've spoken to Lisa Blint. You would be. She's been telling me all about the Atlas obsession with Satanism, Ryan. Then if you've met Lisa Blint, then you will have worked out for yourself that she has a very vivid imagination. She also has... I hate to agree with the devil yeah. ...psychological problems, diagnosed psychological problems, as a matter of fact. So where did she get the idea that you lot were um, <laughs> devil worshippers? <laughs> that betrayed is quite incredible. Insane. She's frightened of her own shadow, bless her. She actually thinks that demons are possessing her even now. You really can't. <laughs> 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 there has never been any devil worship at Atlas. I don't even know what devil worship is, Inspector. It's not something. Whoa! What the shit? You are full of shit, sir. The devil at Atlas. We even tried to help the poor girl by Then what the attention. devil is all this Satanism you were into as a kid? It's easy to offer someone help when they think that you're the problem. I tried to get with her, she turned me down, now she thinks I'm a demon. I tried to give her this necklace, Dad said it was an ace move. Uh, you're a piece of shit and you are a liar, slam dunk! So you used to read a lot about voodoo and satanic rituals, but... You don't know anything about devil worship? Well, obviously, I just meant we don't <laughs> worship the devil. We're not devil worshippers here at Atlas <laughs> <Atlas. laughs> Ridiculous. But the point is, Ryan, that you claim Ridiculous. not to know anything about it, but admitted you were obsessed with it when you were younger. Are you sure none of that made its way onto the Atlas course? And that Lisa isn't basing her beliefs on anything within that course? Lisa isn't basing her beliefs on anything other than her own imagination, Inspector. Look, we do use some techniques that some students. Where's his left hand during all this? Jerking off. The whole thing. <laughs> yeah, like, we encounter I've never seen it. Things different. Very silent. Oh, there it is. Hey, there we go. And some people <laughs> aren't up to that. Some people, like Lisa, uh, that's why we introduced the aptitude test. What's the aptitude test? This. Do you like the devil? Yes, <laughs> yes no. Yes, no, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Will you go out with me? Yes, no, maybe. Signed, Paul. <laughs> you students to... Yeah, extra credit. Uh, medical history, psychological issues, that kind of thing. Any medication that they have used in the past. Any medication... You seem to have a lot of people <laughs> killing themselves on this course. Are you sure you're really looking at it? <laughs> Basically, it's just to try and make sure that we don't get another Lisa. Has it worked? Well, touch wood. So no. Uh, yes. Can I keep a copy of this? Hmm. All right. Okay. Aptitude test. I wonder how much importance they actually give to this test, and what are they doing that's so disturbing anyway? I don't know. What are they doing that's so disturbing? Why don't we find out? <gasps> A next, next time. Grand Kira, DFS plays contradiction. Spot the liar. Contradiction. Spot it. Oh, is this on? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh. Well, folks, thanks for joining us. We've uh, got some more con contradictions to find uh, with Jenks, and uh, but if you want to watch you something else, keep this part in. <laughs> but if you want to watch something else over here, we've got the finale of Nekopara for Yes Yes Love Adventure Go. Insert your own cat pun here, because I've already made plenty on Twitter. Uh, and over here on the right, we can watch Vegeta play that new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game that I hear is so great. I can't wait to see what opinions he has on it. I am sure it was fun. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I've been Grant, and this has been TFS Gaming Play Contradiction. Please come back. Solid. Good. Good job. Good job. Good job. I'm never doing this again. <laughs>